We're here today at Oldham College for the UK Skill Electric Final. It's a two and a half day competition. We're now well into the second day. The competition comprises of installing containment systems such as steel conduit and PVC trunking conduit. Also doing a good bit of wiring and following on for that, they're installing circuits such as lighting, power, control circuit and an EV charger circuit. Throughout the two days, they are given a one hour allocated time slot. Here they have to isolate a single phase and a three phase circuit as well as carry out fault identification and rectification on seven faults that are introduced one at a time. I'm quite happy today, got the fault finding done first. So now I can just concentrate on the rest of the install. I'm kind of just focused on what I need to get done. I kind of got a plan, so stick to it and hopefully it will come good. Further ahead than know what I thought I was going to be, so that's always a bonus. Um, just got to do my electric vehicle charger, wire that up tomorrow and then start the testing. I had a bit of a hiccup with a stuck in dice, so lost about 45 minutes playing with that. Back on track now, uh, trying to focus on doing my uh, ring main, and I'll probably start doing my lights, trying to finish it off by the end of the day. Like to finish my sockets and my lighting today, and then leave the motor circuit, the car charger, and the board for the morning and the testing as well. Going well. Uh, I'm ahead of where I thought I would be, to be fair, so um, just got a couple of little things left to do. I don't really feel the pressure, to be honest. Um, I just go with it, just look at what you're doing, don't really bother with who's watching you. But just as long as you focus on your own stuff, you'll be alright. I just kind of focus on my booth, focus on what I'm doing. You see the cameras coming and going, but you just keep concentrating on what you're doing. I'm finding time, the scale, all right. I'm leaving things tomorrow so I can go a little bit tonight and then come up tomorrow with a fresh head. We mark within millimetres, so it really does come down to those, those marginal gains. What's really going to give them the edge is that mentality, keeping cool under pressure, if they make a mistake, being able to move on from that. We tend to introduce new and emergent technologies into each year's final task, and this year it's EV charging. They'll be providing a supply to it, plus data, then they'll inspect and test it as they would part of the installation and then finally functionally test it. Training is massive to make sure that the young generations understands the capabilities and requirements. We really see the renewable sector being a huge part of their career moving forward. Kind of long two days. It's good to get it finished within the time frame as well. Um, when I first looked at it, I thought I was never going to get it finished, but good to get it finished and have a bit of spare time at the end as well. Just with a perfectionist that I've got inside of me. A few things that I would like to change, but they're done now, so there's nothing you do about it. It was a long three days, but I really enjoyed it. All of the competitors did a really good job, so it was a really tight field. Proud of what I've done so far, but I'd, I'd like to go further and stuff like that. So here, here's hope in the morning, so fingers crossed. We're working under pressure um, for the this, this short time frame that we had, uh, managing to get everything done, tested, and all to a good standard as well. Um, so yeah, I think that's uh, something to definitely take away from. It was a great experience for the whole week, uh, even relating back to uh, London's event. Got it all done, quite happy with the result. Hopefully uh, it will give me a place somewhere. Well, I'm definitely proud of myself of what I've achieved and I've got through it and it all works and it's staying on the wall and look, I'm going to get some marks because there's something there. So no, I'm definitely proud of myself for getting here in the first place. Amazing competition here at Oldham College again. All eight finalists worked their hearts out and very impressive, very impressive with the end results. This competition changes your life. 